Help support our coverage with a free account on Privacy, the service that keeps you protected when shopping online. Get $5 to try it now by using promo code QZZ2J. And with Blueberry, the community that gives creators the power to make money, get detailed audience measurements, and host their audio and video. Get a 30-day free trial by using promo code BLUEBERRY004. Nice to meet you. And you are from what company? Uh, we're from Lovo. Okay. Um, I'm a founder and CEO of Lovo. Oh, I'm honored to meet you. Thank you for, for coming <laughs> on. That's great. No problem. Um, I'm very much looking forward to explaining Lovo to you. We're looking to hear, you know, we want to hear about it. Yeah, so it's a voice creation platform okay. that content creators can come over, enter whatever they want to say, and then create high quality voiceovers without accessing any voice actors. Okay, so I have a, I have a script, mm -hmm. X, a, X amount of pages, whatever it is, let's just say it's five pages. I have the, in, a, in a Word document or a text document right. or whatever it may be, mm -hmm. and I'm going to load your software, which is called Lovo, Lovo, Lovo Studio. Okay, and when I go into Lovo, mm -hmm. I now have the ability, instead of paying a bazooka amount of money to some guys who are really talented, I mean, I know some They're really, I've been in this They're business almost 45 years. Yeah. I know I don't look that old, but, <laughs> but uh, there's some really talented people. I'll tell you a story about one of them in a minute. Uh, this is going to do that for me. Exactly. That's a exactly. tall order. Yeah, it's ambitious. That's a tall order. And so like, tell me about this stuff. Um, these guys, voice actors, they not only sound good, but they're able to express subtle emotions. Oh, my God, yeah. They're able to act in, in very subtle ways. Yeah, and, and the breathing. I mean, there's a lot exactly, to, to exactly. the voiceover. Okay. And so what we're trying to do is instead of doing traditional TTS, we're really trying to model the humanness of speaking, you know, like acting, expressing emotions, allowing machines to express emotions. So, okay, so... Available on what format is this is this software going to be in? So it's a web application. It's a web application. Yeah, you just log in, type in some text, and then voila. So I'm going to upload, and then it's going to yeah, download exactly. for me. Yeah. And I have my choice of voices. Yeah, you have about, right now, 55 voices available. Really? Yeah. Men and women, I'm sure. Exactly. Men, woman, and, child, old and people. And is this fee-based? Um, yeah, it's subscription-based. Yeah. Okay, and yeah. What, what are the prices on that? So we uh, it's like three tiers, so uh, free tier. And then basic is like $29. And then enterprise is like $100. Um, and is this a month? Is this per, 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 per month, speech? Per month, or? Yeah, okay. per month, yeah. So the differentiation between the two, uh, free would give me what? So it would give you like limited access to all the voices, but like, you know, like 5,000 characters a month just to try it out. And if you really like the voices, you can sign up for the paid content, uh, paid uh, tiers, and then um, it will give you access to create personal um, personal usage for basic tier. And an uh, enterprise would be like commercial. So are you making money with this? Sure, sure. And a lot of our users are actually creating high quality advertisements and promo videos for like radios like Alexa sure. or like Spotify. And for those people, they would have to sign up for uh, enterprise. Do we have a, a sample, a demo? Yeah, sure, yeah. Okay, now we're, keep in I, mind, we're, uh, not, we're not plugged into a microphone uh, per se, users. so, pardon me? I'll like get closer it, to a computer. Wait, uh, I'm getting the thumbs up for wait a second. Let him do it. Okay. Perfect. All right. So this is going to be a demo now of of a script. Yeah, it's a radio ad. Um, a radio ad. Okay. Yeah. So can I call this? Investments as if they were their bills. Hiding money under your mattress. Contrary to popular belief, investing your financial assets in a government savings bond can help your money grow. Our team of professionals at Global Transact House and Home will raise and nurture your investments as if they were their very own. We're very protective of our young. Trust our experts to take care of your hard-earned money and make it work for you. Is that? that sounds pretty good. We okay. We have another one? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay, so real quick. So that was that was produced from artificial intelligence. AI. Yeah, that was a computer, yeah. Wow. <laughs> That doesn't sound AI yeah, at all. Yeah, that's why I want to hear a male. Yeah, um, let's try another one. Interesting. That was a little softer, right? Scott, how's that sound? I can't hear. Uh, I, w in post, we'll be able to sure. kick it up. Yeah. But okay. I, wow. I, uh, cool, huh? My headphones are 
turned up way louder than sure, yours are. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, that sounded great. Right. I yeah. can't believe that's AI. Yeah. So. Um, that's pretty impressive. We're trying to get there. We're trying to get there. Um, I mean, uh, we can't. We still can't get over the human acting. Like the the emotion part is just sure. not there yet. But we're but what about tone tonal quality? If I wanted someone with a raspy voice opposed to a, a smooth voice, yeah. is that delineated when I go into the website and I can have my preference? I want this. Exactly. I want that. Yeah. So all of our voices have hashtags, um, and like they have the voice qualities, and you can search uh, using. So the I could li I could sample them before I exactly I select. Exactly. What happens if I if I if I do one and I for whatever reason I just don't like it? Um, you can request custom voices. So I know you're a fan of your own voice. Maybe I don't no, know. I'm not actually. But go ahead. <laughs> I mean, your voice is majestic. So like, you, if you want to create a voice can from your voice, we can do that too. You just need to. So read you can a, you could clone a voice. -ish. Yeah, you can read ten minutes of the script, and then we can just. You can use it right away. Really? Yeah, so. So I, I mean, can have my own virtual here. Don Bain? <laughs> 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 why would you want that? That's what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> right. I don't know why I was. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty fascinating. And how long has this product been on the market? Um, we launched just a month. So, so you're, you're we're, we're brand spiking yeah. new. Exactly. Very interesting. And uh, how do you go about processing or using the voice using the voice yeah in other words how do you decide what voices are going to be in that sample pool um so we get a lot of requests from our customers as in like this guy wanted like a scottish voice that would be used in some viking setting and we would go about um, searching for voice voice actor partners and then we would partner with them and some like revenue sharing deal and then we'll collect our data and then create a voice scan of them, allowing our customers to use it. Okay, so you're the CEO and founder of this company. So right. this was your brainchild, this was your idea? Yep. Where did you come up with this idea? Well, so I realized the machines are beginning to talk to us and we're beginning to talk to them back in a very natural way. It's just that the bottleneck is that, you know, these machines, they don't sound natural enough. And we thought if machines can talk to you in a more natural way, humans can express them themselves in a much more easier, faster, and more creative ways as well. So it goes back and forth, back and forth, just um, machines benefiting humans and humans benefiting machines. Um, so that's how it got all started. So you're dealing primarily with, uh, I don't want to say discovering, but but tinkering, I hate to use that word either. It, it's it's the lo logarithms that are that are giving you the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, what are, what are the future plans? Where do you see this product going? Right, so we want to get this to actual acting, so in games or in animations, um, in places where the subtle acting is required. Um, right now, we're just dealing a lot with advertisements and promotion videos, and a lot of the emotions conveyed in those videos are pretty uniform. They're all excited, they're all like happy, but um, we want to express wider range of emotions. So, so I don't want to say the problem, but the challenge right now is to uh, facilitate the emotional delivery. Exactly. Of the script, if you will. Exactly, and that. And what, what does that? Yeah. What 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 are the pieces of the puzzle to get that to work? Right. So. Or do you know the pieces of the puzzle? So I mean, we're just beginning to scratch the surface. I think. <laughs> um, Pretty human, fascinating. Human emotion is actually very complicated, and like. Me, my, myself, like, I wouldn't understand, like, what emotion I'm feeling right now. <laughs> it's pretty complicated. So, well, um, if you're on this show, you're dazed, you're confused, but go ahead. <laughs> um, conveying emotions requires a lot of interdisciplinary studies, not just AI and, like, psychology and, you know, like, oh, of course. cognitive science. And it's just a challenge to get all of those knowledge into one thing. Um, and I think AI and just psychology and everything will just converge into one point. And then Do you think that? Yeah. It's just, people call it singularity. I don't want to throw that buzzword. No, no. Out, but, uh, um, yeah, I, I think so. I definitely think so. So would you say that your product is, is, is you're actually using artificial intelligence, or do you feel that it's math, it boils down to mathematics because it's in a logarithm? Um, so you follow my question? Yeah. On, on Fair question? The most basic building blocks of AI is mathematics. Um, it's just that the math, math is compounded in a way that no humans can understand. <laughs> well, there's a lot properly. of nuances that are in there, but that's kind of the, the key to the, to the brain, to the soul, whatever, whatever you want to call it. But it's interesting that you're at the point where you can actually uh, modify that. Is that a fair word or no? Yeah, yeah, I mean. 
capture it and modify it. Exactly. Um, humo- like the way we express emotions in our voices, um, people initially thought there were six emotions, but then it just keeps on branching out into more subtle Now, do you actually emotions. go in and observe this or, or document that in your work when you're trying to... Yeah, exactly. exactly. You do? Um, we try to see what, what kind of voice can convey what kind of emotions and what kind of settings. And um, it's just a new field that we're exploring because, um, yeah, it's just new. It's Do you just, expect to have more voices? Yeah, we're adding about three to five voices per month. Really? Um, a lot of our enterprise customers um, uh, request custom voices, like, monthly. So in the plan, we have um, two custom voices monthly that we are able to generate for them. Um, yeah, and it's exciting. And part of the process is optimizing, like, um, creating new voices um, and, like, requ- um, reducing the required data possible um, to create custom voices. Is there a limit on how long the script can be that I want to no. upload or download? And it comes down as what, an MP3, a WAV file? A WAV file. Yeah, a WAV or file. MP3, yeah. yeah. Um, if you want to send us 500,000 words, we can do that. You would just be costing us a lot of server money. <laughs> So how, how long does it take to get, uh, you know, a typical three-minute script? Um, three minutes. Is it in real time? It would typically take about three minutes. Um, we're right now working on streaming um, so that once you click the button, after a buffering time, you would, like, listen right away. Um, but right now, it's three, if, uh, 10 seconds of speech takes 10 se- seconds of processing time. So do I get a link, or does this download automatically? or does um, it, so Where does it... It shows on the uh, web app that, that it's loading, and then once it's done, like, uh, you can come back to the web app and then download it. Yeah. Pretty fascinating stuff. I mean, you guys can try it out, too. <laughs> oh, we're, we're definitely going to try it. They might be trying it out now. Look at them. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> uh, I will definitely uh, try that out, and I'll have you back on the uh, Gadget Professor show, and we'll, we'll actually put the software up, and we'll oh, cool. give you exposure to the international yeah. audience that we have, and uh, it should be yeah, Pretty can, interesting. I'm going to definitely try this out. We can make an AI voice of you and then compare side by side. That's pretty scary. If, uh, people no, we'll have to do that. I think my <laughs> listeners will find that quite quite fascinating. Uh, I could see a lot of applications for this for, you know, from a business standpoint of view, not only like public relations to make commercials and things, but there's a, you know, a lot of uh, uh, re- necessity, uh, or necessary requirements to do different types of voiceovers for, uh, you know, like video production and uh, just, I, I can go on yeah. and on, even lectures. Uh, E-learning, yeah. Uh, that's a huge one. And also, uh, you know, uh, software training. I mean, mm-hmm. y- you know, y- you want to hear a nice, pleasing voice. You might want a woman, you might w- want a man, you might want someone that has a, uh, an Australian accent, whatever the case may be. And now right. you have the ability to take one script, and correct me if I'm wrong, and I can get a plethora I can get multiple people right, right. reading that same item. And that's where the power for advertising comes in because everybody likes different voices and we can create thousands of different versions of the ad and then target customers. What um, about language? Language, um, right now we only do English, but we are able to expand to any um, languages that use that originate from Latin. Say that again. Any languages that originate from Latin, so like Spanish, really French, um, yeah. <laughs> so it can go global, um, but right now we're focusing on. English. Charlie, I'm I'm definitely looking forward to testing this app out. I will test this out probably later on tonight when I get out of, out of <laughs> CES when I get out of here. But I'm definitely gonna, if you like, have you back on the show and we'll, awesome. we'll spend a, we'll spend a whole half hour, an hour. Yeah. Just just checking this out because it's really cool. Yeah, it's fun to play with. Yeah. Great. Thanks Charlie, so much. thank you so much. It was a real pleasure. I wish you the best of luck. Your booth is around here? Yeah, it's at Eureka Park, so okay. come on. I'll, check it out. Yeah. I'll definitely make my way over there. It's cool stuff. All right. Real cool stuff. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thanks.